results to the subscribers. At last, we will. Oh, <laughs> oh, hello. Hello, everyone. It's the Lego Brit here, and it is time for the results. This has got to be one of, if not the most anticipated video I have ever done on the channel. It is time for the results of the Lego Brit 2500 competition. And wow, 154 entries, a new best for the mock contest on the channel. This was the most successful mock competition ever. And guys, to the 154 people that entered, honestly, that number just blows my mind. Thank you so much from the bottom of my heart. Thank you for taking the time to build your mocks, to film videos. It just means so much to me. And of course, your reward is coming. Three of you very skilled mock builders who entered will be receiving these poly bags. So I'm very excited to share that. Let's get on into it. Also, before I forget, I'd like to say a massive thank you to Red Bricks Productions for putting together the intro. It really means a lot to me that you did that. You must have taken ages to do that. So thank you very much. You showed all the entries in a fantastic way. I thought that judging my 100 subs microfighter mock contest and my 1k subs battle pack mock contest was hard. Well, Lego Brits, think again. This was hands down the hardest thing I've ever had to do in my time on YouTube. To go through all of these entries, the incredible amount of entries that we had, to watch them all, to comment that has been entered. This took so much time, so guys, please smash the like button. I really hope you appreciate all the effort that I put into this. Behind the scenes as well, judging it, it just took forever, so hope you enjoy. Also, go down to the place and watch each other's entries. I'd love to see the community really interacting after this, so make sure you go and like each other's entries and support each other, because that's really what I love to see. But, without further ado, let's get into the honourable mentions. I do usually like to give a bit of a recap of the prizes, so that is what's on screen now. I don't particularly want to read it all out again, because honestly, to edit it, it is a nightmare, and it takes forever, so the prizes are on screen now. Let's get the hype up, let's get the hype up in the live chat of the premiere and in the comments. So, let's get into the honourable mentions, but before that, I have a shout out I'd like to give. I do love giving a little extra shout out in each of my competitions just to shout someone out who was this close to being in the honourable mentions. In this case, drumroll please, it was Barber Bros Productions. Congratulations on the shout out. I really love the terrain you did, the different colours, your use of slope pieces was flawless. There was a black border that slightly exceeded the 8 times 12 guidelines that I gave, but I decided to overlook that and just kind of look at the mock purely. It's a brilliant mock, really great work guys. One more thing before I get into the honourable mentions, yes I'm really squeezing all the worst time I can get out of this. No, that's not what this is about. I just want to say that at this stage, if you're watching just the videos released, the winners do not know who they are. So you can't skip ahead because hopefully it should be a premiere. But even if you're watching afterwards, just after it's released, the winners do not know who they are. I haven't emailed them, so it could be anyone. The first of five honorable mentions. Why did I do ten? The first of five honorable mentions is going to go to Lego Monkey Films. Congratulations, your Imperial Assault on Scarif base. It was absolutely outstanding. I really love the explosion effect, really worked very well, and the little details you added, the colours spot on, really great work. Getting closer and closer to these bad boys right here, but not yet. Our second honourable mention is going to go to Captain Rex Builds. Congratulations! Your clone base was really good. I love the different textures of pieces, the way you built plants, and very nice editing. Honourable mention number three is a bit of an interesting one, and that was for Stop Motion Bricks 1. Now, you kind of bended the rules a little bit by including three minifigures. Tut, tut, tut. No, I'm only joking. I decided to overlook that and imagine there was only one because I love the texture. The slanting of the wall, it was just fantastic, especially how you did that in such a small size of the mock. I just thought I had to give you an honourable mention, so there that is. I chose to award the next honourable mention to Micah's mocks because your Coruscant Repair Shop mock was absolutely fantastic. The different techniques and pieces that you use just work so well, and the backstory, the backstory. Wow, you could have written a whole Star Wars movie just based around that mock. That was precisely what I asked you to do. You came with such an interesting backstory, honestly, you had me hooked. I did get the cup of tea, as you mentioned in your video. So I highly recommend you get a cup of tea and a crumpet. Fantastic work, really great work, Micah's Mox. I'm holding a Darth Maul mask and you shall see why. My final honourable mention is going to go to Clone Commander Brett. Sorry, Darth Maul. I'm just going to drop that because it's a little bit weird that I'm holding his head with your Maul Reborn. Now get it, Maul Reborn, holding Darth Maul mask. Never mind, but your Maul Reborn mock was fantastic. I love how you kind of edited clips of the actual scene in the Clone Wars just to show how accurate it was. It was very, very close to being in the winners, but just slightly didn't make it. But outstanding work. I really love the recreation of the scene. Keep it up. For the first time ever on the channel, the third prize will be receiving a poly bag. So one of these, it'll be
me which one the first prize and second prize doesn't pick. So, I am very pleased to announce that the first person to win a prize will be... Sanders 3 Studios, specifically, I know you enter three times, so that is your Mandalore mock. Honestly, that is way better than the actual set, the way you use those techniques. Guys, you are Lego masters. I think you should seriously go on the TV show. The way you build that just, guys, fantastic. So many people saying, I think you're going to win, I think you're going to win. I just had to give you something. So, congratulations, we are getting dangerously close to first prize here. In second prize, we have... Nemo Nesquel, you'll be receiving one of these poly bags and your mock was absolutely amazing. I love the building, the different textures, the colours, the custom minifigure you created for it, different plants. Overall, this looks like something I'd want to have on my wall. It was a work of art, so absolutely outstanding. Really, really close to being first prize, but congratulations, you'll be receiving one of these poly bags. All right. It is time to announce the winner of my LEGO Brit 2500 competition. And oh my goodness, how hard was this? But there always has to be a winner. And that's really what I was leaning on. There always has to be a winner. I had to choose. And when I saw this mock, my jaw dropped. It was outstanding. So I am incredibly pleased. This person should be so proud of themselves. I am so pleased to announce that the winner of my LEGO Brit 2500 mock contest is, drum roll please, ND Brick Productions. Three words. I loved it. When I saw it first, I was just blown away by the sheer creativity of it. And I just thought, you know what? We have a winner. I, there was no doubt in my mind that you were going to be the winner and you completely deserve it. I saw it and I was like, wow, my jaw dropped. Amazing work. You get first choice of which one of these you get. I love the originality. You know I'm always saying be original and you did precisely that. So congratulations. You'll get first pick. Let me know in the comments which poly bag you want. From the bottom of my heart, I'd just like to say a massive thank you to every single person that thought, you know what, I'm going to get the bricks out, I'm going to build something to submit for the LEGO Bricks contest to try and support his channel. And guys, the support that you gave just blows the mind. Thank you so much for all the support. So let me know in the comments what you thought of this whole competition. This took ages to do, so make sure you smash the like button. And if you're not already, please consider subscribing. Hope you'll have a wonderful day. Goodbye. <laughs>